Who's excited for the fourth? It's concerning and it's not a happy time. Yeah, okay, definitely not quite as festive as other years. You know, this year we just bought some sparklers at the grocery store. Speaking of fireworks shows, just about all of them aren't happening. You can buy your own, but it's risky and not really nice to your neighbor's dogs, including mine. Wilmington could have held their show, but the mayor decided it's just not worth it. You know, as much as we'd like to do it, I just think we can survive one year without it. We'll be okay. Wilmington City Pools, including the Joe Biden Aquatic Center, are open under limited hours. If everyone doesn't maintain their distancing, though, they too could close back up. The plan for me is pretty much just going to get some crabs, some shrimp, and just uh, stay in the house and bugger up. Philip and his son avoiding the beach crowds this year. They'll be staying closer to home and doing some more of this, enjoying quality time in safe outdoorsy spots like Brandywine Park. Maybe this year a good time to stop and smell the roses much closer to home. Bill and Tony out for a little pre fourth practice picnic. Yeah, definitely masked and different, but I think you can still have fun if it's done right. This weekend, I plan to do a lot of this bike riding and trail hikes with my family, get a lot of outdoors time, then go back home and maybe fire up the grill. And apparently, I'm not the only one with the cooking out idea. Whatever we have, pretty much they buy. At Howdis Market in North Wilmington, endless cuts of beautiful meat. This shop has lost a lot of the restaurant business, but they are slammed now as customers are placing their orders for the weekend. Right now, it's burgers and steaks and chicken, but we have veal and lamb and fish. And Listen, if you're watching this story, it means you're alive and hopefully healthy. Even in this weird year, try to enjoy the holiday weekend. At some point, you have to come out and, and try to be sensible, but still enjoy life. In Wilmington, Tim Furlong. Happy Fourth of July. NBC 10 News. <laughs> and it's going to be a very different 4th of July, but we know many of you still celebrating, and we want to see your pictures. Post them on Twitter or Instagram using the hashtag July 4th Philly and tag NBC Philadelphia. We may just show them on the 4th. you got to stay tuned for that show. Mm -hmm. Aaron and I will host it 8 p.m. to about 10 p.m. at night.